Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. Homeschool is driving me fucking crazy. It ain't been that long. I don't want to be nobody's fucking teacher. So I'm going to check. Give me a motherfucking check then. <laughs> How y'all doing, Leo? Hey, a breath of fresh air. Somebody give me even a fresh air breath. You need somebody that's like a fresh breath of air or you need some air? <laughs> okay, fresh air seems to be important this week. You know whether you need it. Needed to uh need to cleanse your air or your environment, or you have um met or will be meeting someone that's like a fresh breath of air to you. For those of you who met or will be meeting a fresh breath of air, well, you're needing to mow the line and remove the snakes about your grass because you got snakes out there slithering. And this fresh breath of air might not be so fresh if the snakes get the slithering out there, you know what I mean. Going to attack that fresh breath of air it might be a problem. Snakes in the grass can't cut that line, damn it. Okay, so in other words, the sneaky, slick, untrusting people around you got to go. Okay, it's been a lot of untrustingness in your in your guys' readings lately. Okay, um, that's why I feel like the fresh air, fresh environment, fresh energy space, all of that will be beneficial for you. Out with the old and in with the new. You've been through enough and you deserve some things too. Get to season. I mean, get to cleansing so the new can come in. Cleanse that shit out. Out with the old and with the new. I'm feeling that way myself, Leo. How y'all doing? How y'all doing? Uh, okay. Let's get to it. God. Universe. Angels. Spirit guides. What messages do we have for Leo? For the week of August the 11th. Messages for Leo for this week of August. Third. Four of Wands. Something about stability here. Ace of Wands in the reverse. Ace of Wands in the reverse. What else we got? Leo, you could just be not be feeling it, you know, not feeling the spark, not feeling passionate, not feeling it, you know, just feeling, it's just one of them days that a girl goes through when I'm angry inside, I don't want to take it out on you, <clears throat> can't sing, we know, let's be one of them days or one of them weeks. Don't take it first, no. I just want to be all alone. And you think I treat you wrong. I want to take some time out and think things through. I know it always seems like I'm doing you wrong, but I'm so in love with you. <laughs> all right, what else we got, Leo? Let me stop playing around. Ten of cups. Ten of cups. Ten of cups. Okay, so you can be in a happy space. Okay, you just be having one of them days and stuff sometimes. Queen of Wands, okay? Feeling confident, knowing what you want. Taking action towards it. What else we got for Leo? I feel like that Queen of Wands should have came out first. Because I had to go find her. I knew she flipped. So let's switch the Queen of Wands up here. Because I just feel like even though you hadn't been feeling passionate, you're getting that back with the Queen of Wands. And that's when you're heading on to your happiness. What else we got? The Magician. The Lovers and the Fool. Three major arcana all popping out. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I knew it was a fresh, fresh breath of air nearby. She might be looking at you just like this. Hi, Leo. <laughs> Or he two more out here for Leo. Two more cards for Leo for the week of August the 11th. Two more cards out here for Leo for the week of August the 11th. I just got these cards in the mail today, y'all. So the only people I got to use them on was Pisces and y'all. And that's only because I'm running late with our readings because I ran out of. Really, I hadn't run out, but I just couldn't get to y'all yesterday. 
three. We just need one more. This is a six of pentacles. One more. This fresh breath of air could have been around here and you've been procrastinating, huh? For some of y'all. And this last card is the Ten of Swords. With the King of Swords on the bottom. The song's Yindi. I don't know what that is. We got two tens out here. Something's in it for something else to begin, I guess. Where's my clarification deck? Okay. We got the four of wands, the ace of wands, and the queen of wands. Four of wands, ace of wands, five of wands. Conflict. Jealousy. Um, distractions. Obstacles. Challenges. Okay. So you can feel like you want something stable. I want to work towards something stable, but you just hadn't been feeling so good. Just haven't been feeling so passionate. So, you know, like nothing, like doing nothing. But I feel like um, that's changing or has changed because the Queen of Wands comes in. She confident. She confident. She's all that. She's feeling it. And she knows what she wants. Okay. So you might have been feeling down or not so confident like you normally do, but that's coming back for you here with the Queen of Wands. Then um, during after that, you so that's going to like catalyze you to meet somebody that's going to be like a ten of cups happy. But you manifested this through whatever you went through last time. You let yourself know and you let the universe know what you want and how you want it. Okay? So you've been manifesting this lover situation. Okay? And then we have a fool where somebody's going to take a leap of faith. Bring in the balance. Okay? And put it into something. Pie being scared. <laughs> Pie being scared. <laughs> What's this four of wands here for Leo? Why is this four of wands here for Leo? What's this four of wands? Why do you show up the four of wands for Leo? Two of wands. A decision made about stability. But it might have been made out of lack, okay? When the person felt like they didn't have nothing, it felt like they was like something that felt left out in the cold, okay? So you might have not been able to see the, see this uh passion and new beginning okay and the stability in it because you were in the cold making decisions you were making decisions out of a state of lack out of a mentality of lack here you couldn't bring any emotions like that people can only be seen walking away when they got the wrong damn glasses on now come on ace of wands in reverse i just feel like because you were from a lack you made a decision to not jump on this beginning okay and i think that's changing for you now you see it for what it is. Ten of Cups. Ace of Wands in the reverse. Why is that here for Leo? Ace of Wands in the reverse. Why is that here for Leo? Magician. He's out here twice. The Magician and the, the Knight of Wands. Okay? Something that you really want to chat charge towards passionately okay which you didn't realize that you had all the tools you need to manifest this or that you was manifesting this so you didn't take it serious so you didn't look at it the way you should you looked at it as the ace of wands in reverse when in actuality that is the a path a destined path that you should be taking but you didn't see it clearly because you was coming from a state of lack when you made this decision okay queen of wands that's what i feel like you i just feel like you went through some healing or some building yourself up or something. It's confidence stages that made you more confident, made you see more clearly. Had to be healing because only hurt people see wrong. I mean, not only that, yep, it was healing. You was a wounded warrior, but you put the burdens down to those hurts, okay? Nine of wands and the ten of wands. You was wounded, okay? But you got over it. You put the burdens down to being hurt. So now you can see who you really are. A bad man, my jamma, or a bad Mr. Jamma, but still, you made it. Now you ready to be happy again. What's this Ten of Cups? Ten of Cups. Ten of Cups. Ten of Cups. We got the Five of Swords. And the Ace of Pentacles. Trying to get to a new beginning, are we? But it's something in the way. Some obstruction. Some conflicts. Something's in the way with this Five here. Hope it's not lack again, okay? Something's in the way. You having this new stable beginning and the ten of cups, emotions, emotional fulfillment. 
Five of Swords. What is this? What's the conflict? What's the conflict? What's the Five of Swords conflict? Why is the Five of Swords here for conflict? 10 10. I was on the clock when I just looked at it. 10 10. Breaking down to a 1. 1 and 1 is 2. 2 is a decision or a choice. Doing the work, standing in your truth. It was hard to heal. That's what the hardness was. To look back on what caused you pain. What caused you to be in this wounded warrior. What you need to let go. What's hurting you. What's you need to, what is it? What you need to look at. What do you need to evaluate? What do you need to see different? And boy, did you do it. Because now you out here as a magician with your all eyes open. That, that chakra is open. That third eye chakra, wide open. Now you see it all. Now you see what's up, what's going up, what needs to go up. What's the magician here? Magician. Why is this magician here for Leo? This magician, why is that here for Leo? Why is the magician here for Leo? Your all, all eyes is open now. Your all seeing eyes open now. You looking. The magician. Yeah, you know what you're looking at? The blindfold is off. Because you don't need those eyes to see. You're using this third eye chakra. And it's open. You see it all. So you're no longer confused. Now you know what? You need to go put some work in. You want to work on it now. You want to work on this connection. The fresher breath air. That's supposed to be who this fresher breath air is. She might have been lying around, or he might have been around a lot longer than I think. Than not seen in the meditation. <laughs> the lovers. Why is the lovers here for Leo? The Empress. And the Seven of Pentacles. So, you feel the connection. You know the connection. You know this is your Empress. And after assessing, reassessing, looking back and thinking, dang, what could I do and how could I do it better? Boom, this is you here. Ready to have this new beginning with the lovers. With your deep connection. Ready to take this leap of faith. The lovers on the bottom again. Ready to take this leap of faith. What's this full card? You ready to take the fit? You can't take the leap now. Because you see clearly with your third eye, with your intuition, with your inner knowing. Okay? Nobody can tell you better than that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. What is this full card? You. Sitting out there looking up. What am I going to do? How am I going to do this? Where are my ships? Are they sailing in? And if not, I need to go track them down because I got a happy place to be. Taking that leap of faith with your fresh, 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 fresh breath of air, which I'm assuming is this Empress. Oh, they go to lovers coming out again. That's what you're doing. You want this lovers. You want to balance it. Why is the six of pentacles here? Six of pentacles. Why is that here? Leo, this is beautiful. This is beautiful. Trying to get through this, so it might not be so beautiful. Another card coming out of balance. Two balance cards. Why is the Six of Pentacles here? Balance and harmony. Why is the Six of Pentacles here? For Leo. The Six of Pentacles for Leo. Why is it here? You know truth, you know what's truth, you know what's fair, you know what's balance. And you're going in to put the work in to what you know. Because when you know, you know, you know. Right? Because when you know, you know, you know. That's just it. When you know, you know, you know. Now you know and you want to put the work in. The work is coming in to balance the situation. How do you do that? You put it into something. Something you got to put it into. The disappointment from the past. Okay? Thinking that everything's everybody gonna disappoint you. Ten of Swords. What's this Ten of Swords? What will Leo be putting into? Ten of Swords. Ten of Swords. Justice. Three of Cups. Ten of Swords. Why is the Ten of Swords here? Ten of Swords came out again. Yep, that's what you're putting it into. Okay.
came out on top of the Five of Cups. <laughs> the ending, double ending to past disappointment. Anything that hindered you from the past, anything that stopped you from seeing clearly to the future, it's ending. It's over. You know why? Because justice is here. Time to balance out the skills. Have an equal give and take. Time to go out and celebrate with friends. Time to be reunited and it feels so good. Okay? Time to head towards that higher level of commitment that you know you won't now. The union. The twin flame. I mean, the, the, the spiritual connection. Okay? The, the the connection that feels like a soulmate. There you are, Leo. Looking at the horizon, being strong, waiting, just when. For somebody say when. When am I going to take that leap of faith? Because you know what's there. Ten of Cups, your happiness. Do we got anything else? Let's see if we got anything else for Leo. Regarding this spread. And then we're going to get some advice out here for you. Walk away from what? Eight of Cups. Eight of Cups. King of Swords. I mean, Knight of Swords. You had your back turned towards the truth? That's what that was. You all looking out on the horizon, walking away and looking at the wrong things while you walking away and hurt. And you had your back towards the truth. Something that was happening all of a sudden. You had your back towards the potential of something st stable here. That this night was coming in to show you. That you couldn't see. Because your back was turned. Oh, but you see now, don't you, Leo? I think you do. If this ain't you, this is them. Energy can be fluid. So just know that if this is not you, this is them. But somebody's in the picture. It's somebody. Somebody. So we've got to get some advice here. And the reason I'm clearing this out because I like these cards that I got down here. I want to get advice from them. I just got these cards today. Today they're my favorite. I just love how they let my intuition be free. Let's get you some advice for what you head on out, Leo. God, universe, angels, and spirit guides. What advice do we have for my lovely Leos regarding this spread? For August 11th, what advice do we have for my lovely Leos regarding this spread? For August 11th, advice for Leo regarding this spread for the week of the 11th. Advice for Leo regarding this spread for the week of the 11th. Three cards. Advice for Leo regarding this spread. The week of the 11. Okay. The Emperor came out. The Tower. And the High Priestess. I feel like that this week is letting you know to take charge, okay? Don't um, feel the need to have too much control, okay? Because once you do that, your intuition cannot be heard. It's very important for your intuition to be heard because the High Priestess came out in the reverse, okay? Which could also be that you are going to. Um, be revealing stuff. You're going to come out and communicate something that you might have been holding near and dear to your chest as well. And if not, you need to. You need to with this emperor. Because if you don't, it might cause you a tower moment. Okay, if you don't just speak what you need to say. what you need to say. Say what you need to say. <laughs> I, just, I just heard that. Okay. Princess Cups on the bottom could have to do with emotion. Could have some emotion. You need to go in there and talk to somebody. But guess what? You're too busy covering up your cup and staring. But you need to go in there and do it, Leo. <coughs> oh, excuse me. So, with that being said, guys, that's what I got for you this week. I got my link. Blow that candle out. I got my link down in the description box for merch. Okay, for merch, I got extended earrings. They come about right here. Then I got little ones if you don't like extendeds. I got bracelets, and I even cut back to where I made necklace and one bracelet set for six bucks. Any jewelry on there is going to be less than twenty dollars. Okay, so check it out. Go shop with me. Spend something. Okay. <laughs> I don't know why I felt the need to say spend something. I don't know. It just came out. Okay. So with that being said, if this resonated with you, Leo. Give me a thumbs up. If you're not subscribed to my channel, get on on that subscribe button because it's a whole lot of good energy on this channel and I don't know why you would want to miss that, okay? 
So with that being said, I'll see you guys next time. Good luck with this, Leo. You all at know that. You can do whatever you want to do. Follow your heart sometimes. You need to put them swords down sometimes, okay? So with that being said, I'll see you guys next time. Namaste.